Bishop. I am Kate Bishop from the Young Avengers and from the new Hawkeye books. Are you part of nerd culture? Yes, very much so. <laughs> I'm proud to be part of nerd culture. <laughs> They'll be our tour guides explaining Calgary's first ever comic expo, POW! Parade of Wonders. Nerd culture has become really big lately, so that includes everything sci-fi, comic books, fantasy, steampunk, horror, everything like that. And um, there are comic cons and comic expos all over the world, especially North America. Mostly, they'll try to explain nerd culture to me and why the Calgary Comic and Entertainment Expo has become such a huge event. It's just, there's so many nice people and so much within nerd culture. There's something for everyone. Fallen Warriors! Oh, this is just fun. Yeah, I, I spend a lot of money at these things. Uh, these are some of the highlights of my year, for sure. And it's a great time to spend time with my friends and share our interests and to meet people with similar interests and to meet celebrities that I've admired my whole life. And yeah, it's just really fantastic. Batgirl Emily Lasseline is a Calgary born and raised supervisor at Starbucks. Is this your first comic expo? No, I've been going at least eight years now. Haley Fox, AKA Kate Bishop, is a student from Vancouver, BC. You're also going to meet like stars of Star Trek and lots of other franchises that people are very interested in. And you get to buy a lot of like nerdy memorabilia and jewelry and t-shirts and uh, really cool vendors. A lot of artists come and sell their stuff and tend to spend a lot of money at Comic Cons. <laughs> There's a bit of a rise of proud self-identifying nerds and geeks and I mean I'm a very proud nerd. I'm very proud to call myself a nerd. Most of my friends are very proud to call themselves nerds. And yeah, it's a great thing. This is humongous. Like I've been pretty much waiting since last year <laughs> for this to come back. This year's Comic Expo runs till Sunday at Stampede Park. The event is sold out. Rick Donkers, CalgaryHerald.com.